A very happy Monday to you all. I'm Kenna. Thank you so much for joining me. And welcome to Fatal Midnight by... <laughs> by Sweaty Hand. <laughs> uh, and in Fatal Midnight, Dan wakes up in the middle of the night to unusual sounds in the house. Concerned about his sister, he decides to check on her. Entering her room, he discovers that she is gone. Dan rushes through the house in search for his sister, spurred by fear. Sounds interesting. And when you have Fatal in the title, only good things are going to happen, I'm sure. I will leave a link to this game down in the description box below, but uh, without further ado, let's wake up. My parents went on vacation and I was left to look after my sister. She has some problems. Sometimes she's very strange, so I have to look after her. Everything was fine until I heard strange noises in the middle of the night. E. Damn, those sounds. My sister's probably feeling bad again. I have to check on her. What, did she chop wood in the house when she feels bad? I do think I recall seeing something in the game's description about, oh god, this movement and this FOV, in the description about N4BA having something to do with this, which they did Nine Child Street, Welcome to Kowloon, and I can't remember. I've played another game by them. Well, I know this asset, this house asset, this was in Nine Child Street, and I think it was used in the voidness. All right, I guess we go, mom, dad, I guess we go find her sister. I do believe there's a bedroom down this way. Ooh. Sis. And like it doesn't, really focus until you stop. Sis, it's strange It's strange that she's not here. I need to find her and ask how she is. Um, let's see, are you hiding? So, mission, find sister. Oh boy. I don't, she has some problems. I, I, mm. This is like a laundry room. Yeah. This is so weird to have your laundry room upstairs. I don't understand it. I do like the layout. I mean, aside from the laundry room being upstairs, <laughs> I do like the layout of this house. This would be such a cool house to decorate for like Christmas and whatnot. Okay, that leads back into the hallway. I do believe this is a bedroom. Yeah. I think this is also the asset used in uh, Para Eyes. Um. <gasps> Oh my god, get some soft scrub and clean your tub. Hey, uh, well, the, the tiles cracked. There's a couple of tiles missing. Oh my god. Okay, vampire. That's us. Okay, we heard some wood cracking. Oh, children of the damned. And uh, sis is gone, but I haven't really heard or seen anything else. I would love to have this big, like, I guess ensuite office. That'd be awesome. Can we open these things? Oh my god, we can. Okay, nothing. It's simming mom and dad's room. Can't see a damn thing. That'd be horrifying if she was in there. Um, okay. Yeah, this movement. Oh god. Just smacking myself in the face. This movement and the way the graphics are kind of, kind of fuzzy. Let's 
Jesus. <laughs> oh, the foghorn kicked in. Something bad's about to happen. Sophia Loren? Um... I don't suppose I could just leave and let let sister have. No, okay. Can I open the fridge? Oh! <gasps> oh my god. That's a lot of alcohol. All right, I'm just going to assume just leaving your plates out. You want ants? That's how you get ants. I don't. Yeah, this is this is the same house asset that's used in Para Eyes. Okay, um, I don't. It's strange. These doors were open before, were they? Okay. I mean, really, the only do we have a holy crap? We have a run, kind of. All right, I guess the the basement. I think this is a basement over here. Oh, that's dark. That's sinister. I haven't inspected the house. I need to check it first. What? Where else do you have to go? Oh, 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 oh. I forgot the living room. Oh, she just... She just locked herself in the bathroom. Alright. Uh-huh. Something gonna pop. Hello. Is there something behind the shower curtain? Oh, we're doing that. Can I? Ooh, I, you know, sometimes like these. That. Sometimes it can be overused and cliche, but I don't know, man. Sometimes it still gets me. Why are you opening so slow? Stop it. I'm gonna, like catch her right out of the corner of my eye or something. Oh my God. One day I won't. Hey. Okay. She's probably gone to the basement. I need to follow her. <sighs> I don't see anything. The light is out. I need to find a flashlight. It's on the second floor near the computer. Ah. Man, I hope she's worth it. Second floor computer, that'd be in mom and dad's room. This is the room where the flashlight is. Thank you, game. Uh, is that an elephant? A picture of an elephant? Ah! Oh, and it's a big one. Oh, God. We got the low rumbling in the background. Here we go. it is in fact incredibly dark and she's crying and she was doing s oh god okay she's hold on wait my face is just okay sorry <laughs> okay God, what? No, why the heartbeat? <laughs> oh, God, okay, that got me. Ugh. Oh, I think that what was that. There was, I didn't catch that. I'm sorry. My, that was one of those 
like jerks that it's like you feel it from the pit of your stomach and it like travels up into your esophagus or something, you know? Okay, you know what? Um, the sister can just go F herself. I, I just say we leave. Can we leave? Okay, we need to go this way. Oh my God. Oh, this is one of those. Okay, if you run the flashlight like cranes down and you can't really see anything, that's terrible. Is there anything else down here? If I remember correctly from Nine Child Street, it's a pretty damn big basement. Okay, I think it just loops around. Okay, whatever, okay, let's... I guess we go back upstairs or something. Wow. Yeah. Better than a cup of coffee in the morning. Oh. The power's completely out now. That's fine. Oh my god, we've got pieces of the... Yo! Ah, floorboards! Has this always been this way? Why is it... First my sister knocks me out and then the lights go out. Effing great. Um, what happened? Why are we in a... Crazy dilapidated house now? Oh, great. Fantastic. I'm... Okay... Yeah, I'm coming. Why are you echoing? Motion, motion. Hey, son. I know what happened to her. Go to your room. Under the bed, there is something that will help you. Ooh. AI. <laughs> that's not that's not really good. <laughs> uh, I need to go to my room. There's something under the bed that will help me. Um, I'm sorry, did mom and dad leave me? No, or leave us, I guess I should say. Knowing full damn well that sister was gonna try some shit. I don't appreciate that at oh. oh. Did she run into my room? My door's closed. Oh jeez. Mom, Dad, we're going to have a discussion about this when you get home. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, my God. What's wrong with my screen, too? Do you see? I've got, like, fingerprints or something on the edges of my... Okay. I. What am I supposed to do? I can't get in my room. Yeah, I'm hitting... I don't know if you can hear that. I'm hitting E. Nothing's happening. Is this one of those, I walk away and then it unlocks. Yeah, like everything got 10 times worse looking. Did I just hear the door creak open? I probably did. Oh my God, I did. Alright, what's under the damn bed? Do I have a crouch? Wait, what am I hitting? Oh, I do have a crouch. I don't... I'm hitting E, is anything gonna happen? Oh, hi? I'm sorry! Alright sis, it's go time! <laughs> Oh God, this is a nightmare. Oh, I hear, I hear the pitter patter of her feet, bro. I can hear her walking around the first floor. I need to find her. Oh God. Oh, 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 there she is. Okay, she's 
she going around? Is she going around? Oh God, this is nerve wracking. Okay, I'm sorry. No, she came in this way. Oh, God. It's like, why is it so dark in here? I can barely see anything. Okay, yeah. Wow. This is the most horrifying game of cat and mouse. How many shots do I have? Oh, oh god! I don't want to go that way, it's really dark. Oh god. Why is she being so weird? Just go. Wow, this is taking forever. Terrorists <gasps> win. What? <laughs> what? However, shortly after this fatal midnight, the police arrive on the scene and arrest Daniel. As it turns out, he was that, okay. As it turns out that he has a mental disability and is taking pills, this led to the tragic incident. In reality, the sister was trying to get away from her brother by hiding from him to preserve her life. The sister was not possessed by demons. It was all Daniel's fantasy. Neighbors who heard her screams and gunshots impatiently called the police, hoping to help the unfortunate girl, but there was no way to save her. The girl was shot with a shotgun. Daniel was put in a mental hospital there. <laughs> he realizes what happened. <laughs> Holy crap. Jeez. So, okay, the whole terrorist win thing is, did he think he was playing a video game? I don't know. Okay, I was not expecting that ending. Okay, so, you know, I'm going to exact, because I have no idea of that. I have no idea if that, that music is copyrighted or not. Okay, so all in all, a very, I think, effective short indie horror game. I like the tension. I like the atmosphere. Um, uh, what a what a swerve at the end there, though. Um, <laughs> geez, why, why do these people never just, I don't know, walk through the door and leave the house? Are they incapable of opening doors? And if the doors are jammed or locked and they can't get out for, for, for whatever reason, your house is full of chairs. Throw a chair through the damn window and go out that way. I don't understand this. This, this insistence on not getting yourself out of harm's way. Anyway, uh, that, that end half where you're trying to find her, that was oddly effective and very nerve wracking. Um, the FOV and the kind of very fuzzy, hazy graphic setting really, I think, added to it. So all in all, I really enjoyed this. The, the twist at the end is fine. Like, I don't, I don't necessarily, I, I, I don't know. There, there was something about it. I, I, I don't know if it was the wording of it, because it, it looked like they're, you know, uh, I don't know if maybe English isn't the first language or whatever, but the sentence structure kind of didn't flow um, in certain areas. So I don't know if it was just that. I, I feel like it could have been presented 
in a more succinct way or something along those lines. But yeah, all in all, I enjoyed it. Short Monday indie horror for you all. You can always let me know what you think down below in the comments. Again, I will leave a link to this down in the description box below. And everyone, thank you so much for joining me. I always do appreciate it. Tomorrow, I have somebody coming in the morning to that needs to get up in my attic. That sounds really dirty. <laughs> but my legitimate attic um, for inspection purposes. So I'm going to try and have something up. Um, but if you do not see me tomorrow, that is what's going on and I will try and be back Wednesday, but that's kind of up in the air. So maybe I'll see you, maybe I won't, but until I do see you, you all have a fantastic Monday and I'll see you next time. Bye!